Popular Ghana actress Bella Makafuyi has been arrested, according to reports, by the police and the drug regulatory body in Ghana. That is something a lot of people are really talking about. And this person is a wife to one of the Ghana's foremost artists that is a person of medica. And they had issues. And many people are really trying to connect the whole story and it's trending out on social media. I'll give you that report. But before I jump right in, I want to say thank you guys for watching our videos and thank you for the love so far. If you are new here, you can click the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos. Big ballers are coming to Umwenze. That is coming in from Kubana Chipris, who sent condolence messages to a person of uh, flavor, Nabania, uh, for the loss of his father. And a lot of people are really pouring in their heart and their condolences to a person of flavor and that is trending out on social media and a lot of people can really understand that you know it's a painful death for this guy although his father has been a bit ill or sometimes now but nobody celebrates death flavor was sad to announce that on social media but right now the lies of kubana chief priest is coming out to say flavor we are with you and we are going to come there and ball with you on that day. That is what is really trending out on social media. What are your own takes about this and what is your own message to Flavor Navania on the death of his father? I want you to put that in the comment section. Let's talk about something that is happening in the music industry. A lot of people are really gearing up for the coming Grammy nominations. We have African category already. Some people are really prepping themselves for this particular thing and the likes of Arasta is launching an album right now or dropping an album we have a lot of persons that dropped album and we have the video in the studio working on new things right now and some people are saying that don't be surprised the video is going to get a nominations at the Grammy based on his outing in 2024 and in 2023 while some other persons are saying Bonner Boy got a lot to offer at that Grammy nomination and it's gonna be all interesting at the end of the day. Do you think that the likes of Rema, the likes of Tyler, the likes of Arasta will make it? this time around and we have Temps that has dropped an album and a lot of people are really gearing up for that and saying that Temps got a lot to offer in terms of music right now and she may get nominated at the Grammys because she is a really really a big artist out there that is something i can really share with you let's jump on the story of things happening in ghana right now a popular actress in ghana has been arrested for selling fake drug that is according to the report we're having right now flying on social media a lot of people are really trying to connect some kind of things and some kind of change in that story remember that fella makafuyu is uh, a wife to uh, Medica, a Ghanaian artist, and uh, they had issues trying to co-parent their daughter. And this is escalating. And a video of them actually having altercation made it to the social media. And a lot of people are really pointing at Medica right now to have organized such thing. Why some other persons are saying, man, this lady may be guilty as F, you know, based on the whole story. But according to a report, they said the farm organization of Ghana has actually come out to say you know what most of the drugs you are selling they are unregistered so they are term fake and that was why she was arrested and many people are quick to blame it on others what are your own takes about this i want you to put that in the comment section but one thing you need to understand is that if those drugs are not registered that is fake for me and the authorities they've not done anything wrong about that if those drugs are not registered with the appropriate authorities. That is one thing I can say. I don't believe in you know the sales of unregistered drugs because that can really encourage a lot of people to do counterfeiting, and that is really disturbing and it's really a challenge for developing nations. I think right now a lot of people can really understand that when you produce something, you have to register it with the appropriate authority before 
it can be certified acceptable by that particular country. That is one thing we are really getting to understand about this big story. But stop blaming medical on this. Whether you like it or not, she erred according to a report and she didn't register her product so she deserves to be arrested you know that is quackery for me that is uh, you know kind of uh, you know counterfeiting for me that is one thing i believe about that but many people are really blaming this on medica and saying that this could be as a result of uh, the differences she is having with medica on some certain issues but that is not the case at all based on the report we are really getting. I want to show you something. The lady that was accused or that is being accused of ending uh, the marriage of Basket Mouth, the 12 years old marriage of Basket Mouth, has been unveiled on social media. That is what some blogs are really talking about, like what you're seeing on the screen right now. I want you to put your own comment in the comment section so that we can talk about it further. But I believe that, you know, nobody decides to earn marriage. I think a lot of differences must have played out in that marriage. That is why they decided to earn it in peace. And now some people are trying to blame Miss Vic for ending the marriage of um, Basket Mouth. That is what a lot of persons are really talking about right now. And you need to understand that when devil wants to creep into marriage, you have to understand the activities of the devil. It may come in thoughts, it may come in actions, it may come in different forms. That is what many people don't seem to understand. The thought you have for your partner, you know, matters a lot. And that is what the devil takes to work to understand. Yes, this little Nollywood actress is coming out to drag her father out. That is a person of Sharon Ifedi. And she is coming out to drag her father saying that, tell them how you hit me and allowed me to die. And now you are calling me a selfish daughter. That is one thing that is trending out on social media. A lot of people are making big stories around this. Banky W survived fourth cancer surgery. That is a big win for the family of Banky W. According to what he shared on his social media, the video is gone viral so far. And this time around, a lot of people are saying their prayers for the family at a time like this. What are your own takes about my story? I want you to put it in the comment section. Before I jump off, I want to say thank you guys for watching our videos and thank you for the love so far. If you are new here, you can click the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos. I love you guys. Keep supporting Afro B blog across social media platforms. He's he himself is his level is level of performance. Perform. Is that nigga perform you perform for two hours, thirty minutes without splashing water on anybody. You know, and you know this in my without splashing water on anybody. And you know, and you know this without splashing water on anybody.